Aaron Rodgers loves what Deion Sanders is doing in Colorado, big fan. Add New York Jets quarterback Aaron Rodgers to the list of admirers of what Deion Sanders is doing with the Colorado Buffaloes football program. Rodgers, fresh off his Achilles surgery after he was injured Monday night, spoke to the Pat McAfee show about a variety of topics, including his intentions to play football again. Rodgers made sure to bring up Sanders Buffaloes, saying he is a big fan and it's because of what his Jets head coach, Robert Sala, has been saying. Sala said this, if there's a lot of crows pecking and a lot of people less talking, he must be doing something right, Rodgers told the show. They shut up the team that was in the national championship in week one. And somebody said something in week two, right? They shut them up. Somebody just said something in week three now, and they're about to shut them up, too. Rodgers has dealt with his fair amount of haters in his 19-year NFL career, and Sanders can say the same whether he was playing or coaching. Rodgers was also referencing what fans, experts, and even opposing coaches have been saying about Sanders and his coaching methods at Colorado prior to shocking TCU in Week 1 and blowing out Nebraska to move to 2-0. The Week 3 comment Rodgers was referring to was what Colorado State head coach Jay Norvell said this week before the Rams and Buffaloes meet in the Rocky Mountain Showdown Saturday night. Norvell took a jab at how Sanders wears his hat and sunglasses during press conferences and TV interviews, which Sanders took personally. Rodgers also likes what he's seeing from Sanders' quarterback, his son Shadur Sanders, who got props from the four-time MVP for his 510-yard Week 1 performance against TCU. Travis Hunter, the other big star for the Buffaloes, has a fan in Rodgers too. The other kid that plays both ways? He's incredible, Rodgers said, pointing out Hunter plays receiver and cornerback. There's one final reason why Rodgers respects the Buffaloes. I love it because they only had one win last year, and it was against my alma mater, he said, referring to the Cal Bears.